Cohen. We're here tonight with HBO Max celebrating the holidays with a very special triple feature screening. Let's take a first look. Hi, I'm Christopher. The network wants me to find out if Christmas movies are worthwhile. I'm gonna be on set for all of production. That's not necessary. If I had some ideas about the script, do I talk to you about those or? Being in the entertainment industry and watching a movie about the entertainment industry, yeah. making a movie, it was so cool. Awesome, yeah. that's so good to hear. Yeah. What was that feeling like for you? It was a trip, it was my first time doing that, and you know, you got two, two boom operators walking around, two directors, two first ADs, you know, and, uh, but it was, it was a blast. We, we had a lot of fun, and, and it's fun when you cut in the scene, and then you cut in the scene, and, but in real life, you know, and <laughs> yeah. So. And I heard you shot, I mean, a lot of it here. What is it like now, celebrating this moment and being back on the lot? So cool. It's so sweet because it's Warner Brothers. You know, like I, I met my wife who produced another movie on this slate, and um, we met under the water tower, and and then we filmed it here. And so even when the car dropped us off, there's scenes where I'm in a go kart, you know, pulling through these streets and almost getting thrown out of it. And then and so driving here is just like ah, memories, you know. Yeah, it's kind of surreal that we're literally having the premiere where we filmed. Um, it's really fun. I just feel like I should probably go be filming somewhere. I feel like someone's looking for me right now, but that's not true. So this is exciting. Yeah. So what was your favorite part about making a Christmas movie? Uh, so my favorite part about making a Christmas movie always is the fact that they're typically filmed during summer. Um, and you're boiling and you're wearing turtlenecks and all of this like warm holiday gear. And for some reason, the, the magic of Christmas makes you forget about how warm you are, you know? <laughs> we need to follow the formula. Big city boy meets small town girl. They have conflict. Christmas magic is like snow in LA. There's no such thing. It means everything. I'm so excited to be able to bring like a perspective as an Asian woman and to get to share that. It's like, it means everything. And and honestly, I'm really excited to be able to share my grandma in this movie as well. Like that, that is just really <laughs> magical for me. Yeah. Cool. This is like a meta meta moment because yeah. we're on the back lot we are. and you did a movie about a movie. So I feel like full circle. Lot. <laughs> yeah. I'm back at work, so I'm not even sure. I'm like, are we celebrating or am I just going, should I get on set or do we have scenes to shoot? What's going on? I think I think what was really fun is that because it was a movie within a movie, there, the lines were kind of blurred as far as like all of this could be in the shot and it wouldn't really matter. It's like if you had a, you know, a Starbucks cup or something, you'd be like, oh, okay. <laughs> so you could kind of use everything. Uh, it wasn't, all, you know, it didn't have to match perfectly. So it's fun. So, and also, the writer is um, the writer and producer are my best friends and my daughter's godmother, Christine Moore and John Ducey. So, you know, I'll be outside sometimes and they'll be like, "What do you think about?" You know, we're all sort of writing, coming up with ideas for these movies. So, you produced a Hollywood Christmas. And you've written two of the movies. This is true. Yes. yes. What is it like now, everything coming together on this night tonight? Well, oh. it is kind of overwhelming. Yeah. Yes, it's very exciting. No, earlier today, I, I saw, on, oh, I can't even talk about it, Little Violet, who's the lead of A Christmas Mystery, her red carpet look, and I was like, oh my god, I'm already up to here. I, it's, I, we haven't even started. I haven't even seen anybody, and I'm all just about to cry. Logic doesn't save Christmas. Love saves Christmas. Can I trade you in for a talking dog? Not according to my contract. You are like the bringer of goodwill here tonight. Thank you so much. I'm happy to have that job. Do you have it in the movie? I mean, let's talk about your character and what it, what it means to you to play a character like this in a movie like this. Well, Rena is all about Christmas magic and she knows the formula. I myself am like a huge Christmas fan. So I can connect a lot to Rena with all of that. I, I'm, I'm kind of obsessed with Christmas and so is she. So that it wasn't too hard to channel all of that yet. What is it about this movie that you think will warm audiences' hearts? 
I think just the authenticity that is brought to it with the story itself. You know, the story is simple yet complex when you're diving into the character developments and how some people think that it's a forever thing and then it's not. I don't want to give away too much, obviously, but at the end of the day, I just think that as much as it's a Christmas story, it's a story about how people interact with one another and the relationships that, you know, can be brought up during Christmas times and how miracles during the holiday season I feel like happen a little bit more now than throughout the rest of the year. You know, there's just more love and magic in the air now. So, you know, more possibilities, more possibilities. The way I see it, this is why everybody loves Christmas so much. Is it's it's the it's at the end of the year, and it's like everybody goes through a year, and there's ups and downs, and there's just the general stresses of life, and then you come to Christmas, and everybody just wants to to chill. Everybody wants to relax and have a good time, and so that's. With a Christmas movie, you, you want to deliver that. You, you want to deliver the feel good, but you want to do it a little different because you got to stand out. So that's, that's what we try to do with these, with the Christmas mystery and a Hollywood Christmas.